Hello, I am Bentham and welcome back to Stardew Valley where it is windy and polleny or something like that according to the weatherman. And tomorrow will be the same. I want some rain. Rain is good. It means I don't have to spend any energy watering things. The spirits are in good humour today. That is good. Maybe we'll find a dandelion. The dandelion saga continues. It appears this is a rerun of Queen of Sauce. Stir fry, I believe. Yes, we've already done that one. I guess it shows it like twice a week. Oh, hello! It's Marnie with the dog! Hello, Bentham! You see this dog here? I do see this dog here. I found it sitting outside the entrance to your farm. I think it's a stray, poor thing. Awkward silence. I, I was probably supposed to offer that I would uh, that I would keep him, and then I just said nothing. Money's like, so uh, hey, it seems like it seems to like this place. Uh, don't you think this farm could use a good dog? Uh, will you adopt this dog? Of course, I will adopt this dog. I've already come up with the name as well. I'm going to call it Dog, after a dog in uh, a movie I quite like, which I will leave you to find out. Well, Doug, you be good pooch now, okay? We have a dog now. It doesn't actually do anything. But uh, we have a dog. It's nice. And uh, I believe this is its uh, its bowl. Aha! And we can water it. I have no idea where Doug himself is. I guess we'll see him at some point in the day. Uh, you around anywhere? Here, boy. It, it, I'd whistle, but that might deafen you. So I, I will spare you. But I, he's lost somewhere in this... This terrifying forest. We'll find him one day. But uh, we've got a bunch of stuff. Oh my god, we got dandelions! Yes! We've got so many! Oh wow, we, it's like 50% dandelions. That's Apparently the, the harvest sprites heard, heard my plight and decided to reward me with just millions of dandelions. Yes, finally! I can finally finish the uh, the bundle in the community center and do all the things. We got ten of them! Ten of them! We only planted twenty seeds! This is brilliant. Okay, well I'll get the rest of the uh, of the watering done. I guess we can plant some more. Actually no, we don't want to do that because uh, there's something else we can do. We will leave the fields empty for the moment. We have uh, 200 gold on us, which isn't much actually, but we have everything planted we want, we just need to wait for it to grow. And in the meantime we can get on with other things. Perhaps we will go to the mines today? It seems like a good time to do so. We are using up a lot of our energy with the watering, but we can eat something and we'll be fine. We've now got two free fields. Well, two and a half. Plus the, the bit we messed up with the kale. And here's the jazz seeds. I'm trying to remember what all my different things are. Those are potatoes there. I think we've got cauliflowers in the top corner. And uh, we need to get our watering can upgraded at some point. And make this uh, a lot easier to do. But uh, that is pretty much everything. We just need to do the beans. Which at some point we'll start producing. I'm wondering if it was really a good idea to start straight away with them. It's definitely the most efficient way if you plant them as soon as you can because uh, once they're planted they just keep making more beans, but it's a long-term investment because it's taken this long for the thing to actually like produce beans and it's still not got there and we're like a third of the way through the uh, the season already. Right, let's go sort out our inventory. I think we'll just leave all this stuff at the moment. I just want to go straight to the to the community center now. Uh, we'll grab, there's a couple of things we want. Oh, I sold the potato, didn't I? So I'll have to wait for that. But uh, I think we're pretty good there. There's nothing else. We'll sort the things in a minute. I just want to go straight to the community center and finally sort this thing out. So after all that, after all that searching for dandelions, we eventually just ended up growing some. And you just know that I'm going to find millions of them around the place now. I bet if I go into the forest today, I will find them. But I probably won't, because I'm fed up of searching the forest over and over. We've been there enough times. We'll... Next time we visit, we'll be going to chop down trees and stuff, probably. Here we are. We can finally complete our first bundle. 
Here we are. There's our little slightly uh, overripe apple. It would appear. There. Finally. Bundle complete. A uh, hot air balloon for some reason. And we have a reward. 30 spring seeds. So we don't need to be like crafting them out of the uh, the stuff now. We can just uh, plant those 30 we've got. Also, there's a Junimo running along with uh, with the bundle. And we've unlocked some new stuff. So yeah, there's a, like there's more than the, uh, the five they have available here. There's like different ones for each room. With all different themes uh, that we can make use of. So I'm going to hop up to this one. I think this is the one I was looking for. It is the pantry. There we go, the spring crops bundle. So I knew this was a thing, which is why I kept hold of a parsnip and a potato until I sold it, because I messed up with uh, buying the kale. So yes, we need a green bean and a cauliflower. We're already growing all three of these, so that is good news. And uh, we also have the quality crops, which use gold crops, so we'll try and get some more gold parsnips, which might be difficult. We're already, we're making rapid progress through the season. And then there's ones for, like, crops from different seasons. Animal bundle for all sorts of random gubbins you get from animals. That's a long way off. We're talking months, years there. And then the artisan bundle, all sorts of weird things you have to, like, process. And I think these are all the things you get off trees, and then these are all the things you get off animals. I think... Or just like machines that process animals and, well not animal, animal produce and such. And we only need uh, six in total, so we can either go entirely for fruit or entirely for uh, cheeses and such. Or a mix, depending on how things work out. And uh, yeah, I think that's all the, yeah, it's all the different seasons and then a couple of other things too. And then there's another one over here. Oh, there he goes into his weird half-grown, half-built hut. And the fish tank, so we need to start collecting fish to put in here. This is going to be hard to do because there aren't really any, like, in-game guides on fish. Oh, uh, oysters and clams. I sort of gave all those away. I guess I will come back later whenever I retrieve some more of them. Yeah, so they're sorted by location you fish them from, but different seasons have different fish in different times of day and different weathers. So that might take a while. I'm sure I'm going to miss many opportunities um, for fish and then have to like wait a full year or whatever. Though I think you can get them from... Uh, ooh, there's a, there's a mission. I'm looking for a green algae to dry for the next winter, Linus. I will accept that and do some fishing, I guess, and see if we can sort out the fishing bundle at the same time. But yes, I believe you can catch, like, out-of-season fish from... Well, not catch, you can acquire them from the merchant who sometimes appears in the forest. Right, it is indeed Vincent's birthday today. I need a thing. I don't have any things right now. I think we're going to abort the, the visiting the mines thing for today. We're going to do a bunch of fishing instead. Ooh, I'll say hi to Haley And uh, sort up something for Vincent. The only thing I like about this town is the beach. We were visiting the forest the other day. I, like, you take pictures or something? You have a cat? I think she goes around with the camera. What I say? It's 11.30 a.m. already. My goodness. Oh, what did you say? I still have tons of work to do. It's only the, the morning. Hello, Sam. Did you watch the game last night? Oh, wait. Do you even, even have a TV set? I was actually going to say, like... Actually, I was going to ask you if you have a TV set. I didn't think you did in there. I'll visit later. Actually, I think that's where Vincent is. I don't have my scythe to cut through that. I think I can use the axe, but that uses energy. We'll just walk around. Uh, does Vincent live here? I don't actually know. Maybe. I think, I think yeah, that, that is Vincent's room. Actually, we can check. Well, that's his report card, isn't it? Yes, it is. So I guess he's currently... I mean, it's a weekday, so he's probably being... taught by Penny at the moment somewhere in the town. We'll visit the beach, gather some gubbins for bundles, do some fishing and such. What bits can we find? Is there anything? Is it a good look day? I've completely forgotten. Oh, but there are some worms. We found a book. Why do people keep burying But Was it you, Elliot? I mean, you saw me dig that thing up and you didn't say a word. No, like... Complete amazement at the fact that someone had buried an actual just book in in the sand. 
The forest is a wonderful place. Have you been there? Yes, I've been there, but... I've always been angry while there because I've been looking for something I can't find. We found a single clam. We'll go visit Willy if he's actually in here. He is. I don't think there's anything we want to buy. Uh, bamboo pole. I think that's the fishing rod that we already have. And trout soup. Which uh, we don't have the money for. We'll say hi to him. Some fish come and go with the seasons. Others only come out at night or in the rain. I know, it's it's a nightmare. I don't know how I'm going to deal with it. I forgot to check what the reward was, actually. I've forgotten all the rewards now. But, like, all of the, the groups of bundles give you one reward or another. I forgot to fish. I didn't see any uh, bubbling spots, so we'll have a look around the river and see if we can find any. That'll help speed things up. What on earth do I give to Vincent? I don't want to miss his birthday. Also, I need to find him. He might have been, like, here, because that's where we saw Penny before with the, with the kids. Oh, maybe they're in the library. There they are. I'll read this book. The Fisherman, Act 1. It's a play. Tex, Gordy, how do you catch so many fish? For me, it takes forever. You must make the choice to become a true fisherman, and over time your fishing speed will increase. So you're saying that improving my fishing skill will make me fish faster? Correct. One day you may even learn the secret to creating your very own bobbits, improving your mastery even more. Now be gone! How dramatic. Hello, Vincent. I want to look for bugs, but Mum gets mad when I'm all dirty. It's a tough choice. Indeed it is. These are the decisions you must make. We don't have school here, but I'm doing my best to convince them Jess a proper education. Oh, I tried to speak to Jess, actually, and then it was Penny. And Jess didn't want to talk anyway. Every child deserves a chance to be successful. Indeed they do. Jess is very good at math and reading. Vincent is good at... Well, he has an active imagination. That means you're good at something. Hello, Abigail. Hey, sorry in advance if I say anything rude. I didn't get much sleep last night. What do you want? And there we go with the rude. Like you literally just said, anyway. I don't know why I'm coming over here. There's literally nothing to look at. Can I turn that fire out? No, because I can, I can do that for Linus for some reason. Speaking of, we... Wait, what? I thought I gave him a Georgia Cola. Oh no, oh, it's the reward. I got very. I thought the mission was still there, but I thought, wait, isn't it out of time as well as many other problems? But no, I just had to collect the reward, which is good, I've got more money now. I can now afford a trout soup, but I will not buy one, because that's not a good use of my money at this stage. Then again, I'm about to go fishing. I, I literally, like, I could give him, I could give him the, the clam, I'll probably find another one. Let's just try it, because I don't want to miss him and have him, like, go to bed and stuff without me... Getting to give him a gift. Oh, a birthday gift, thank you. It, it helped. It's better than nothing. It's the thought that counts. That, that's what to remember whenever you forget. Oh. There's a daffodil inside here. Hmm. Now, the thing is, you can't see all of this fence, so I'm wondering if, if you just... Aha! Secrets! All of the secrets! Now, how do I actually get over there? I have no idea. I'm trapped in here. There's a box. Another one of those weird secret boxes. Okay, so there's no actual... So, it's in there, and I can get in there, but not actually over... Maybe one, like there's something I can do with that box that moves it, and then I can get in there? Very strange. Or maybe there's another secret entrance. Let's do a, a whole run along. Nope. And there's nothing around here. Interesting indeed. And there's Pam. Hello, Pam. Times have been tough lately. I got laid off my job as a bus driver. If I got that job back, I could drive you to the Calico Desert. I guess that's a thing in the future. Oh, it, oh I was going to say hi to Sam, but you didn't reply. Have I spoken? I, I, have, I think I have already spoken to Sam today. I was about to say, oh, I need to go to the general store, but of course it is uh, a Wednesday, so I can't. Also, bubbles. And I've overshot it entirely. I'll just recast. It's probably quicker. And we want to try and catch some algae, which managed to be harder if I'm fishing a good spot. Oh, no, I spoke too soon. Of course, I, I can always depend on getting random bits of junk from fishing, it would appear. But we'll uh, carry on for a bit, we've got some time. Linus will always be accessible in his tent, I guess. And actually, I think it's, uh, it's a two-day 
uh, mission anyway. Whoops, I didn't cast Fire off there. A broken CD. That is something I can use later. More algae. No, I've got enough now, thanks. I, I just wanted the one. We're back to fish. I think it was a, a sunfish we caught before, so hopefully that is... Ooh, and a smallmouth bass. Hopefully they are both things we need for the fishing bundles. We can just get a bunch of the river fish bundles sorted. Whoop. Ah, he's on the treasure. That makes it easier. Oh, well, two sunfishes. Of course, I'm getting loads of them now, but it's possible that they may only be available on days where it is sunny. And of course, Maru asked me on a, a sunny day, but the sunny day was immediately followed by a rainy day when I actually tried to do the... Oh, the bubbles have gone. Well, well, we'll finish here. We're running out of space anyway. Steady. Can we get a perfect? Is it a carp by any chance? Oh, missed it. Curses. Oh, it was, it was a bream. Well, excellent. We got three different fish, which is a good sign for getting some bundles complete. Oh, there's Maru. It'll take a, a while to catch up. But I'm, I'm going to be going that way anyway. We still need to get a bunch of planting done today. But uh, we will hop over to the community center and redeem our fish. There goes a, a blue Junimo. You don't get blue apples. As it's, someone's probably managed to create such a, a, a kind. We've got a sunfish, got a smallmouth bass, and a bream. I don't know if they would be in any other bundles. Ooh, bream for the night fishing, but it wasn't night time, was it? Maybe it was. It, uh, it depends on the definition. And, uh, ooh, a carp and a bullhead. We've caught those before. Any space for a smallmouth bass? It's not the end of the world if there isn't one, because then we can sell it instead. I don't see any spots. I'm doing a terrible job of searching. I keep switching between random ones, which is not a good way of doing it. But uh, I think that's that. I don't think there was a spot for algae, but I didn't really check in the... Uh, the one where all the, like, seafood stuff uh, was going... Actually, no, seafood is just fish. That was a terrible way of describing it. The uh, crustaceans will go with. That's probably still wrong, but whatever. You're probably growing a lot of interesting plants on your farm, huh? Yeah, I am trying to grow a lot of different things. Maybe I'll stop by your place someday and check it out. I think the only thing I'm missing now is uh, tulips. What am I going to do today? Probably nothing. Well, it is already 7 p.m. You're sort of a bit late to sort of plan a day. Hey there, Bentham. I was just daydreaming about some new carpentry projects. Stop trying to make me buy a house upgrade. I have, like, £2.92 to my name. Are you doing okay? Uh, are, uh, hang on. I'll start again. Are you doing okay at your place? How's the woodwork in your cottage holding up? I told you to stop. Leave me alone. It's fine. When I have money, I will pay for house upgrades. Oh, what's a stupid place for bubbles? It's taunting me there. When I have the money, I will get house upgrades, but I don't have the money, so stop badgering me. Perhaps the uh, the household is short on cash. As far as I can tell, the only thing they do is sell house upgrades, and, I mean, everyone's house seems fine as it is, apart from mine. Mine's the only one that's wrecked, which is probably why she was the first to greet me as I arrived. And, uh, and the one most interested in, in me taking ownership of the house. I can't blame her. She needs to live. Anything around here? I mean, there's, I don't really, really need to search anymore. I found all the things I need. Everything is good in the world. I should probably just get back home and uh, get on with some uh, some planting. And these seeds will last us for a while anyway. I don't think we have enough space to plant them all. But uh, tomorrow, I think we will grab some tulips. Also, I need to visit Linus. Are you in here? I didn't check if I went past you. I will say hi first. That's always nicer. Hello, Linus. I don't know you well enough to trust you, sorry. Well, maybe this will help. Hey, is that the green algae I requested? I really appreciate it. Let's see, here's what I owe you. And can I... there we go. Oh, I can't talk anymore. What is the reward? 45 gold. Thank you very much, Linus. Uh, that's very nice of you, considering you live in a tent and I live in a house. But uh, let's make our way back home. And now I've cut down on tools a little bit, I have a bit more inventory space. And can actually still pick things up at the end of the day. 
All right, we'll get, I guess, like half of the, the seeds planted. And that'll do. And we'll do a bit of work on the farm, I think, because we should have a bit of time left in the day, but perhaps not energy, actually. I guess we could eat some algae or some uh, spring onions. You anywhere to be seen, Doug? He's out there somewhere, having the time of his life. Frolicking in, in the... Uh, in the fields. Should we plant this as well? Maybe we should just leave it. I mean, one field of it is enough now. The main reason I planted loads was to try and get more stuff. If we just plant the one field, this will last us till the end of the season. I would quite like to get some tulips so we have, like, a bit of everything growing. We can uh, cover all the bases. Hmm. I think the potatoes might grow tomorrow, but then we might not make more potatoes anyway. We'll leave it. We'll just have the, uh, the one field. And that will be fine. We could perhaps plant a couple of extra on a little side field. It's, it's not really a side field, it is in the middle of everything. Now nah, we'll just leave it, it's all good. And uh, we'll plant any sort of wild seeds we find in that spot. Put these away for the moment. Uh, we'll put this away and we'll take out the millions of spring onions, that probably makes a bit more sense. Put away the useless gubbins. Useless for the moment, anyway, and we will sell the sunfish and the smallmouth bass and hope that Maru doesn't ask for another sunfish tomorrow. Then again, as long as there's a sunny day, at some point we'll be able to, uh, to acquire a new one, but let's chop down some trees and such. I believe it's ten chops. And that's nearly all of our energy straight away. And then five chops for the stump. And we've got no energy left. I... we could cut some grass. Actually, I need to get to the wood that I chopped down at the very least. We can get one more chop. And we're done. We are out of energy. That went well. I want to think, I guess it is only 11. We'll eat some spring onions. They don't even give us that much, but we've got so many of them that it doesn't matter too much. That might be enough for another tree. Something along those lines. We'll experiment. We get about 25 energy. Actually, I think it uses like 30 energy to chop down a tree. Also, there's rocks in the way. We'll do that first. Already getting lower on energy again. And it's getting late. I'm going to start using up tomorrow's energy as well. We'll just chop down a couple of bits of wood and leave it at that, I think. I, I, I don't dare try any more because... Chopping down one more thing will use up two more energy, and we have exactly two as it is, it appears. We, we're doing a terrible job of gathering wood. I was hoping I could have the 300 a bit sooner. Well, at some point, we'll just have a bunch of tree chopping get done. Probably on a rainy day. Then again, we want to go to a mine on such a date. We'll work it out. Let us go to bed. And see what we've earned. Ooh, level one mining from just chopping down a couple of... Uh, well, not hitting a couple of rocks. We gain pickaxe proficiency and the ability to make a cherry bomb. And for the 10th of spring, we made a whopping 92 pence. From the sunfish and the smallmouth bass. Smallmouth bass was a pretty decent one. It was also a, a silver star one. Oh yes, tomorrow we will try and get some tulip seeds, I think. Uh, the potatoes might be ready, so we can continue uh, working on that, uh, that uh, bundle in the community centre. And maybe some mining, maybe some chopping, maybe some fishing. One of those things, definitely, at least one of them. Uh, but with that, I shall say goodbye, thank you for watching, and I shall see you next time.